How's it going guys? It's Raider Knight, and today we're playing Ancient Reborn. Uh, I'm just trying this game out for the first time. Uh, well, I haven't tried it out for the first time. I'm making a video on it for the first time. But uh, I've played it for a little bit already. I'm level 7. And I am working to get towards level 10, but it is a challenge. Uh, the pacing is very slow in the game. Uh, either that or I'm just not farming enough. But I do have some decent stuff already. I think, uh, for the most part, I'm enjoying going for the, uh, what's it called, the heavy weapon stat? Yes. There's also a piercing stat and a fencing stat. Uh, mage is not currently in the game, but they do plan to add magic uh, weapons to the game pretty soon, I believe. So, get ready for that when that comes out. Uh, the map is very interesting in this game. You have the starter city of Farm Farmoon? I don't really know how to pronounce that. Uh, you have Bullrock, uh, you have way over here you have Toon Bridge, and you have Senatron, and you have Barville. I think uh, this city is the best out of all of them because this is kind of, you know, where you start out, uh, where you get started essentially, and overall uh, it's pretty easy to get started into this game. Uh, the first spawn location is actually right here. Uh, I can confirm a teleport if I want to, but I'm not going to. But uh, once you spawn into this town, if you go up to the north, uh, you get your first real farming area. Uh, and you can, like, I don't know, you can start out with the chickens, I guess, uh, if you want to. It's way up here in the north. Uh, I'll just go show you guys that real quick. But uh, I've mostly been farming the froggers. I think they're a little bit better to farm. And you can make some better gold, in my opinion, but... Uh, that's just my thoughts. Uh, obviously, nobody's here right now, which is kind of strange that uh, nobody's here, but uh, usually this place is pretty packed, and you can get a lot of experience pretty quickly by farming there. But uh, where I farm is over here by the froggers, and uh, I'm getting close to being able to battle the lizards, I'm pretty sure. But I think I'm, I'm still a little bit off, so might take a while until I'm able to farm those. So over here is the froggers, you can just click them, and you can battle them. Pretty simple stuff. Uh, you have some th buttons over here on the right hand side uh, of the screen, and you can essentially choose whatever stat uh, you're training. The top one is for strength, the middle one is for uh, essentially just uh, accuracy, but they call it uh, dexterity, or however you pronounce that. I know I'm pronouncing it wrong, so I'm not even going to try. And the bottom one is defense. So you can do all that. You can collect the items and you can sell this for decent money. It's not great, but it's alright money. And then you can continue farming the froggers. I think I'm going to work a little bit more on strength. I think my strength is a little bit low at the moment uh, on this game. I think my defense is really good though. I have max armor for the most part. Uh, well... For my level at least. And I think I'm going to work on getting toward level 10 in the future. And being able to farm the lizards that are... Uh, if you saw them, I'm pretty sure you guys saw them, but I'm not sure. They're over here. The iguana is one of them. But there's also a lizard... Yeah, lizard man or whatever it's called. And you can farm those for some pretty good gold, I'm guessing, also. So, that's uh, kind of where I'm at in this game so far. Uh, if you guys want to get the game, again, it's Ancients Reborn. Uh, a pretty fun little game, kind of like Rukoi, uh, but it's 3D, of course. And I think it has a, a lot of pros to it. I think it has a pretty good chance to being a pretty quality game in the future with a couple more updates to it. And overall, I have a high outlook for this game's future. So definitely go try it out, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.